how to send or receive files via Bluetooth on the Samsung Galaxy S5. Now first, press on the home key to go back to your home screen. Then from here, you can slide down the notification panel and tap and hold on to the Bluetooth shortcuts. Once in here, you need to turn it on by sliding the switch to the right. Next, you will need to pair it. So I'm just going to unpair this one here so I can show it to you. Then go to your other devices such as Google Nexus HTC or your Samsung Galaxy S4 or S3. Then from here, you need to go into settings. Then go into connections, Bluetooth. Just going to turn on. And I'm going to make this device Bluetooth available for two minutes so my other device can scan it. So back to my S5, I'm just going to go in to these settings and I'm going to scan. It's already here, but uh, in case if you haven't got it, if you haven't paired uh, before, then you will need to scan it. So once you scan it, it should show up in the list here. Then you can simply just tap on that device for pairing. You can see it says pairing right now. Then just tap on the OK button on this one and on your audio device you also need to press on the OK button and now the two will be paired. Once it has successfully paired, what you need to go to do is go back to your home screen then go into apps and look for my files. So this is the file manager. So tap on the home key at the top to go back to the home uh, directory. From here you can tap on device storage or SD card to browse for files. So let's say if you tap on SD card and here you can choose what you want to um, to share such as photos uh, from the camera or you can choose any files. So let's say if you want to share this contacts file. So just tap on that files and then it comes up with a list of checkbox you can select. So this will allow you to send multiple files and folders. In this case we're just going to share one file. Then tap on the share icon at the top. And then from here choose Bluetooth and then choose the device that you want to send. So I'm just going to choose David Vo, which is my S4. Then my on my other phone, it's going to come up. Um, the S5 wants to send a file. Do you want to accept or decline? So we tap on accept to download the files. You can see it's um, showing the file here. So if we tap on that, you can see in my inbound transfer, it has successfully transferred this context file over to my S4. Then just tap on the home key. Now if you want to send the file to your S5, then just go into your to your file management. And images, uh, let's say, um, just going to try to choose a file, documents, there's nothing in here, music. So let's say I want to send the mp3 files, then I tap on share, bluetooth, and I want to send it to my Galaxy S5, so let's say sending. Now to receive files on your S5, it's fairly simple, just tap on the accept button and it will send, you can see it's downloading the files at the moment. Now when sending files via Bluetooth, it is quite uh, slow in comparing to um, Wi-Fi Direct. I have um, created a video uh, for Wi-Fi Direct. You can watch that video to see how fast it's downloading the files. If you download, if you are downloading um, a 200 megabyte file, it'll be like in a few seconds. Comparing to this, this little one is downloading just a single MP3 song, which is around five megabyte, and it's just taking ages. Um, so yeah, that's how you can um, send files uh, via Bluetooth if you want to uh, to use Bluetooth because some device may not have a Wi-Fi direct. So the, the quickest way is to use uh, Bluetooth. Then just press on the home key to finish. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.